So it's important to realize that we need both love and justice. We're here because we're upset. The prayers inside Burning Bush Church Saturday. People are hurting. We need you right now. The community is hurting. Are for healing the soul of a community. Pray that you would bring us together. And Lord, we're no longer the same because of what with the stories we've heard today. We've been changed. Yes, sir. Today, my goal is to at least have the black community and the Akron Police Department leave with a better understanding of each other. The church is hoping for a candid conversation. I want to see change as much as anybody else. Between police officers. Give us the benefit of the doubt. We, we typically do the right thing. City and community leaders. But it's absolutely imperative to not only talk like now, but you have to listen. And Akron neighbors. I'm willing and I have to be a part of the solution. I know there are a lot of questions out there. And the I exchanges know. come several months after police fatally shot Jalen Walker. His death sparked protests and flamed tensions between law enforcement and the community. You assured me that Akron was different than Minneapolis and other cities. The topic spanning questions, fears, and concerns about gun violence. I lost a niece, a 21-year-old, to gun violence. Mental health. I didn't even know if I should have called the cops, but I seen somebody that was clearly out of their mind. What's going to happen to this person if I call the cops? And biases. There is a difference when it comes to descaling situations if it's in a white community or if it's in a black community. The discussion nobody, at times uncomfortable. Nobody is disturbed about all the death that keeps occurring around us. We don't want to keep making excuses for police officers being um, uh, super aggressive, not making uh, reports in its totality. You see a shots fired, somebody hops out of the car and you go try to press the button, sometimes it doesn't come on. But also insightful. There are more things in common than we have that are not in common. I talk to find some common ground so the people who lead and live in Akron can move forward together. That the people, they want accountability. And better. Are you willing to allow that narrative to shift a little bit? If you're not willing to allow that narrative to change, you are here for the wrong reasons. In Akron. Let them see it in your blessing. We pray it in the name of Jesus. Catherine Ross. The Christ. If there are other religions here, Allah, God, and whoever we worship. News 5. We need you in, in that name we pray.